On February the 22nd, 1976, the News of the World published a picture of Princess Margaret cavorting with Roddy Llewellyn. This photograph of her with a younger man on a Caribbean island, soaking up the sun, apparently as lovers, at a time when the rest of, of Britain is suffering three-day weeks and that sort of thing. It was a game-changing moment. It did produce a rather oppressed friends, as it were. And I think that must have been very difficult for them. What's new? Can you tell me what happened there? What do you have to say about what happened? It was terrible, really. She didn't have an easy life. It may have been part of their own fault, but you know what I mean. Less than a month later, the palace announced the separation of Princess Margaret and Lord Snowden. The Queen was probably quite distressed because it was quite unusual in a way for the times we lived in then. Princess Margaret's love life had been a matter of distress for the royal family right back to the 50s. The royals did not get divorced. The royals were perfect. The royals didn't have marital problems. They were the fairy tale. That was the idea. And affairs and divorces and uh, being exposed, scandal in the newspapers, it pretty much brought them down to everyone else's level. The fact that there was a divorce did change a lot of things, because if you remember, people who were divorced weren't allowed to, you know, go to the garden party. They weren't allowed into various bits of royal Ascot. You weren't allowed as a divorcee near the, the royals. <laughs> well, of course, when the Queen's sister divorces, so they had to forget about all that. It changed a lot of protocol. Divorce from the early years has been the bugbear of, of, of the Queen's reign from the abdication through Margaret. Yet the Queen was torn. Margaret's happiness was also very important to her. It was difficult for the Queen, and I felt rather guilty always, having introduced Roddy to Princess Margaret. But after Princess Margaret's funeral, the Queen, she said, I would just like to say, Anna, it was rather difficult moments, but I thank you so much uh, introducing Princess Margaret to Roddy, because he made her really happy. Margaret's love life shattered the image of a stable and loyal royal family. And that, combined with the outcry over the Queen's finances, was making this the Queen's rockiest decade yet. <laughs>